I manage Barkley Down Station. It's just under 2.4 million acres. I suppose it's harsh, but it's also beautiful. I live here on Barkley with myself, my wife, and our daughter. She grew up on Barkley pretty well. A lot of wives on stations play a major role. Without the wives, a lot of things don't happen on a station. It's not a one-person show. Barkley's a team. Everybody plays a vital role. It's all about communication. Over the years, we've been involved with helping the RFDS with their pilots. Every year, they do their annual night training for landing, and it's our contribution. We take off at Mount Isa, a major town, and come out to a remote area. It could be surrounded by trees, and with a crosswind, it makes an approach and the environment within the runway a lot different to a nice, clear, open runway. That's why you need the training. John, have his crew out there setting up the lights. You know, it all costs money. We've done training exercises out here that they'd stop work for a day and supply people to help us. Probably the hardest working couple that I know. You know up to midnight, get up at four, but they're the salt of the bush and you know, backbone of the nation. They're probably what we'd all aspire to be. Flying Dock plays a major role in the remote areas. Last year, 2017, the, the fencing contractor had the mishap with one of their workers. After I'd pulled my hand out from underneath the dropper, I did see it, I got a glimpse of it. It was pretty bad. My index and my middle finger were pretty much just hanging there by threads. The time they got here, we had the flying doctor notified. The doctors are very good at diagnosing what to do over the phone. The most impressive thing for me for the whole thing was what a great job of first aid the guys had done out there. She had been seen by the crew that was there at the work site. We pulled up at the end of the strip as the Land Rover came in. Looked at the paperwork later, we were nine minutes on the ground from when we landed to when we took off. If they didn't have people like John Leanne on the ground, that result would have been far worse. Somebody's in need of help, you do it. <laughs>